Let's go. Uh, I am Alex Oswald. I'm 18 years old and I come from South Australia. Hi, Alex. Hello, um, <laughs> well, we've just spent, you've just spent three days in Canberra at the yes. AIS. How's your time been here? It's been uh, really good. The facilities are great. The coach is great. All the kids having fun, working hard. So it's been really good. Yeah, good. Um, what have you learnt this week? Um, sort of learnt more about my personal physicalities and sort of my strengths and weaknesses that I can work on. Certain aspects I've never really looked at before. Sort of my my body's range of motion and things such as that. So like my strengths, my actual what I can work on. So that's yep. been a really good one for me. And has was that mostly due to the lectures that you went through? Like your that was uh, mainly because of the um, the test, the sort of the testing we went through in the strength and conditioning centre, sort mm -hmm. of being able to see sort of the power we can actually produce and if our sort of technique is correct type of thing and what we can improve on and work on. So yeah, great. Yeah. Um, so if there's something that you would take away from this week um, and sort of adapt into your daily training, what what would that be? Um, I think after the nutrition talk today, definitely take that in con into consideration but certainly more sort of strength and conditioning is really key for me I mm -hmm. reckon. What was your favourite, like we did a few lectures so for instance the fitness, what was your favourite element within that lecture? Do you mean the one we had this morning? Sorry. Um, so like all the fitness testing that you all did? The um, probably the the yo-yo test I reckon because it's, you're used to just not doing the normal beep test but it's it's a bit more specific to squash mm -hmm. and sport. It's a, uh, it's pretty good. I really enjoyed that one. Yeah. So. Um, and um, what what's what's been your favourite moment through the week? What stood out the most? I reckon just sort of getting the opportunity to come to the AIS and stay here like an athlete and train like an athlete because you know there's there's no scholarship opportunities anymore. There's no real setup for squash, and it's just a bit of a shame that we all sort of missed out on that. Yeah, sure. But, yeah. So if there's uh, definitely more opportunities to do this through 2016, you'd, you'd be happy oh, with that? Definitely, 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Um, probably that's about it. Is there any questions, yeah? Wrap it up. Thanks for your time. Thank you very much.